Images and videos of these horrific explosions are easily seen on television and online. And even if your kids aren't hearing about it at home, what are they learning at school and, and hearing from other students? East Texas News' Shaylee Sanders speaks with medical professionals and school administration about the best way to talk to our children about this tragedy. While some parents are debating how and if to talk about Monday's horrific explosions with their young children. It's the worst thing in the world to tell this small being that somebody has killed somebody else. Other parents say it's already been discussed. I would rather have her hear this from me than from other people. Holly Blanco is a mother of two and a pediatrician who says when speaking with younger children, keep it simple. Bare minimum like kind of facts to give them an understanding, but without overwhelming them or giving them too many details. Psychologist Wilson Renfro recommends waiting for your child to bring it up. You can generate more fear about something that they don't really understand rather than dealing with something that they bring up and then try to handle it from there. High school students at Grace Community School in Tyler have prayed for those affected by this attack. But when it comes to the elementary school students, staff say they're handling it differently. When they bring something up, it, it's just kind of, and this would be for parents as well, to be careful not to answer questions that they're not exactly asking and just listen to them and answer it and answer all the ones they ask. It's a historical fact. It's, it's now a part of our history and a part of our country. So it, it's going to have to be dealt with and talked about. Doctors say, along with offering a concrete explanation of what's happened, don't forget to remind your children of how many people are working to do everything they can to help those in need. Shaylee Sanders, East Texas News. Doctors say it's important for parents to minimize how much your child sees while making sure to explain what happened. And remember that some children may not want to think or talk about these types of events.